now we are going to see about medical research AI agents creation using GPT-40. We are going to integrate all these things in a low code solution present AI. Imagine you have a medical research AI agents. So the first agent is going to research about a sickness. Then the writer agent is going to write about that. Then finally, the editor agent is going to finalize everything. But imagine if the research agent doesn't have access to PubMed or any internet research access. The quality of the output is going to be minimal. That's when we have tools. If we provide PubMed access to the research agent, the research agent is going to use that tool to do its research and finally get a better output. So how can we do this in a more easy format? That's when we integrate Praise and AI with Langchain. If you go and see Langchain tools, there are multiple tools for various different tasks. You can integrate any of these tools with Praise and AI. So how can you do this? That's exactly what we're going to see today. Let's get started. Hi everyone, I'm really excited to show you about Praise and AI integration with Langchain. In this, we are going to create AI agents and give advanced access using tools. So first, we are going to create medical research agents, then assign PubMed Langchain tool to those agents, and then finally run those agents to get a final output. So these research agents are going to search the PubMed repo for the latest research based on the provided topic and provide that to those agents to run. If you do it manually, this might take a lot of time to go through every individual research articles, summarize that, and prepare a final report. But this will make things easier. I'm going to take you through step by step, but before that, I regularly create videos in regards to artificial intelligence on my YouTube channel. So do subscribe and click the bell icon to stay tuned. Make sure you click the like button so this video can be helpful for many others like you. So first step, pip install Prison AI Langchain Community XML to Dict. The XML to Dict is the package used by PubMed. And then click enter. First, export your OpenAI API key like this and then click enter. Next, we are going to use GPT-40 model. So type export OpenAI model name GPT-40 and then click enter. Now we need to create agents. To do that, type present AI hyphen hyphen INIT. Now we can define the task. I want to research about the causes of lung disease. That's it. And click enter. This will automatically create your agents.yaml file. And let's open this. If you see that it created these agents such as research analyst agent, medical writer agent and editor agent. Each time you generate, this will vary. So you can even customize this based on your requirement. So only variation which we are going to do is add tools. So if we go to the Langchain PubMed tool, here are the requirements. It requires XML to dict. That's what we installed initially. Then we need to use this. So if you see that it's coming from tools, PubMed tool. So anything with tools, we can use it directly. Just copy this. So here is our folder. I'm going to create a new file called tools.py and then click enter. Now inside the file, I'm going to paste the import which we just copied. That's it. There's nothing else more to do. Just copy this function, PubMed query run and go to agents.yaml and paste it in the tools section. Now we are ready. That's all it takes to integrate PubMed to the research analyst agent. Now we have successfully created research agents and then assigned the PubMed Langchain tool to the agent. Now this research agent will have access to PubMed using Langchain tools. Now I'm going to run this code. To start running this in your terminal, type present AI and then click enter. That's it. Now first it going to the research analyst agent. The research analyst agent is using the PubMed tool and it's searching for relevant articles about the reason for the lung disease. As you can see here, lung, searching for the keyword lung and then retrieving all the relevant articles which are most recent. After that, using that information, it's passing on to the medical writer agent and the writer agent writes a detailed article, document title, causes and risk factors of the lung disease, introduction, environment factors, molecular mechanism, genetic factors, infections, occupation hazards, and much more. Then that is passed to the editor agent to finalize the article. And we got everything clearly written. Now we can directly use this. In this way, you are able to integrate any of the Langchain tool with Praise and AI 
and do much more advanced research. One more thing I want to show you. In Langchain, there is something called wrapper. So this is from utilities. So if it's from tools, then you can use directly. But if it's from utilities with the wrapper, then you might need to slightly modify the function. So you got Google Serper API wrapper, Search API wrapper, SERP API wrapper. Similarly, there are many tools which also contain wrappers. So how can you use that here? So in our case, we are going to use Tavili Search. It is a search engine specifically built for AI agents. So I'm going to use this. So you need to install like this. And also we are going to use Tavili Search Wrapper. So in your terminal, install as instructed with Tavili Python. Then in the tools file, we are going to import base tool from Prezen AI tools and then Tavili Search API Wrapper. That is a class which we are going to use. Then we are creating a class called Tavili Tool, naming it as Tavili Tool. Search relevant information based on the query. And this is how you call it. And then pass the query like this. That's it. Similarly for Bing Search Wrapper, you can see from the documentation, you can initialize that first and then use search.results and pass the query and the number of results. Similarly for each wrapper, there is a documentation which you need to follow. So for Tavili, there is a query and the maximum number of results. That's it. Now we have integrated Langchain Wrapper in Prezen AI tools. Now I'm copying the name of the tool and replacing that here with Tavili tool. Now instead of PubMed access, I'm giving internet search access to those agents. Now I'm exporting Tavili API key like this and then click enter. This API key you can generate from Tavili.com. Now we are going to type Prezen AI and then click enter. That's it. Now you can see it's using Tavili internet search and it's browsing web pages and getting information about lung diseases. So all this data, if we go and consume manually, it's really time consuming. But this simplifies the process and finally give you the research answer. Same as before, it's going to the medical writer, it's writing in more detail. Next, it goes to the editor and the editor reformats it for publishing. As simple as that. I'm really excited about this. I'm going to create more videos similar to this. So stay tuned. I hope you like this video. Do like, share and subscribe and thanks for watching.